on that. Got it? Is it going? All right. So, <clears throat> um, anyway, so this is how to process acorns. And this is the boiling process, the quick way to do it in a survival situation. This would be the best way to do it. But in a just a normal situation, uh, the uh, cold water method would be the best way. And we'll do that in another video. This is the boiling um, uh, process. So uh, this is excellent for a survival situation if you have a way to make fire and a way to get water. It can get you some quick food loaded with carbohydrates and some protein. Anyway, all right, so here we go. This is the water oak acorn. And I'm going to crack it. And you don't, you want it like this. You want it like this when you crack it or upside down, either way. You don't want it on its side. You want it up. Or down. Anyway, just give it a little tap. Find your split right here. Find your split. That's it. Now, they um, all acorns have a little skin on it, like a like a peanut, and you want to try to get that off if you are doing a cold water method, which we're not doing. But if you were doing the cold water method, you would want to soak these, of course, and then peel that skin off. Now, I'm not going to worry about the skin on these because I'm going to put them in boiling water and they will come off in that boiling water. That's it there. And you can see it's got a little skin on it. Now that skin has the uh, tannins in it, the, a lot of tannins in it, so it needs to come off. However, you can get it off in the boiling water, scraping it off, whatever. Anyway, you've got to boil these uh, to get the uh, tannic acids out of it. You can't eat these things raw. They're too bitter. So there's a cold water method. We'll do it in another video. Uh, this video, we're going to boil the tannins out. And that is the quickest way to do it, but not the ideal way. It is the ideal way in a survival situation because you get quick food you can uh, process these really quick. Anyway, um, if you're going to boil them, you want to uh, put it over here where you can see these. You want to get two pots of water boiling and you'll put it in the first one like so. Of course, you gotta, you've got to crush them up to whatever, whatever size you want. This is a real good size. That way they the uh, uh, tannins come out fairly easy. So anyway, you got two pots of water. You want and they're both boiling. They both have to be boiling. You let them boil for 15 minutes, and then you put them over in the other boiling water. And I'll show you how to do that in a minute. Now, the reason why you do that, you have you've got to keep the water boiling. You got to keep the acorns hot, is because. If the, uh, if the acorns cool down, the tannins, the, the, uh, the tannins will uh, bind to the starch and you won't get the tannins out. So you got to do it this way or else it's just not going to work. All right, let's take this over to the sink. Let's say this is boiled. Let me show you this first. Can you see that good? See, the, see that every once in a while? Let it boil for 15, 20 minutes. Every once in a while, take that stuff off. See that? See that plate? Mm -hmm. 
every once in a while just kind of skim the top and take some of that nasty stuff out of there. You don't have to do that, but that's what I did. All right, we'll take it over here. Let's say it's boiled for 15 minutes. It has not, but let's just pretend that it has. There we go. And we're just gonna stick it over in this one. And you let that boil for 15 minutes. This is the end result. This is what you want. This is already processed. It's boiled for about 30 minutes. And uh, that's it. Make you, a, and it's still, I mean, it's still like kernels. Anyway, I'm going to actually eat this. I will probably put honey on it, maybe some cinnamon. But uh, it's got a uh, bland taste. Yeah, excellent survival food. Anyway, if you boil this, you cannot dry it out and make flour out of it. It won't work. The only way to make flour is with the uh, cold water method, and which that'll be another video. But uh, can't make flour out of it after you have cooked it because it cooks the starch. Hmm. Say acorns. Say acorns? Yeah. Anyway, that's it. We'll see ya.